a lot of people hate the style of my film, but they're all over 50. And uh, my films are really cut like MTV movies. They're fast, and older people just find them confusing. And uh, uh, the television programmers, the gatekeepers who buy these sorts of movies uh, for networks are usually pretty old, and they worry about their audience. They're worried that uh, people won't understand the movie because of the style. So that's a big decision I make. It's kind of almost as brave to shoot, to edit a film in the style that I do it, as it is to actually dodge the bullets when I'm making it. And um, being an artist, I feel that you, every work of art you have to do has to stretch the limits of the medium a little bit more. So while the film's not experimental, it uh, messes with lots of things, like there's this documentary ethic that you're supposed to be detached and like a fly on the wall. Well, I hate that. I love, I love to hug people and kiss them and be involved and have them react to me. And then I, then I become like a bridge between the two cultures. And uh, it always annoys me when um, I, I have to do the Q&A and there's always someone in the Q&A who will object to the fact that I got involved. Like, the worst thing is, yeah, I don't know where, that, it's like the Ten Commandments or something. There's these Ten Commandments of documentary making of what you're not supposed to do. You're not supposed to intervene. You know, you're not supposed to be in the film yourself. You're, not, you're supposed to have it, um, everything's got to be real. You know, you can't improvise, you can't manufacture something beautiful that's like Fellini. You know, you, 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 it's all this very dour, dour, dour approach. And the main thing they hate in documentaries is comedy. And my, my doc documentaries are full of comedy, and I'm the main fool, you know, I'm the idi idiot in them. So, um, you know, that's the style thing, and I get very, very angry in Q&As, like my recurring nightmare is coming to the Amsterdam Film Festival, showing my film and then having to do a Q&A, because you've got all these, it's like the Catholic Church, you've got all these dogmatists, you know, who are telling you how to have sex, but in this case they want to control the way that you actually make a film. And uh, my next film will be even more controversial. It's, it's called Scarface in, in Kabul. And uh, I'm taking my film crew there and we're doing a werewolf and vampire movie. So I'm introducing the supernatural into documentaries. Imagine what they'll think of that. I mean, none of them believe in God or the spirit or anything. They're all, they're all atheists and uh, call themselves humanists and so on. And they're very boring people. It's actually been very painful for me being here because I don't feel like I'm a documentary filmmaker. I don't feel that I belong in this group. Um, there's an Australian film here called Contact. And, uh, you know, it's, uh, you can see that when they did it, they uh, decided, okay, we've got some old footage, so we'll, we'll have to get some talking heads, you know, interviews with people standing still. And then we'll get some pretty cut, of, we'll get some pretty pictures of the desert and we'll cut them all together so that the the script that they would have given to the television station, nothing would have changed. Everything in that that they said they were get, going to get, they would have been able to get. But no television station will fund my films because uh, I have to say, trust me, um, I'm going to go over there and I'm going to make some incredible things happen. But like, it's like the World Cup in soccer, you know, in football. Uh, you know that there's good players on both sides, you know it's going to be a good game to watch, but you don't know how it's going to be won and how, 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 you know, how the points are going to be scored. And that's what I love about documentary filmmaking, um, the fact that you just don't know. I hate scripted stuff. And so this thing where it's creeping into documentaries, you're supposed to script them and give all this stuff to the TV station and if you deviate from it, then they'll come down on you and tell you to rearrange the film. So I fund my own films. I have to find the money myself. And I'm a very poor first person. Usually my films lose money. I'm just falling further and further behind financially every year making documentaries, but I believe in them.